Uh, we had a, a young man, Russell Mieha. Russell Mieha was an 18-year-old kid. Russell Mieha scraped up, scraped up the money to pay full rate tuition. Never said a word to us. Russell Mieha got a fucking bus. Rode a bus from North Carolina to Las Vegas. A three-day bus ride here and a three-day bus ride back. The conference is only three days. He spent six days on a fucking bus just to get his ass here and then stayed in, in local hostels and YMCAs. He's an 18-year-old kid that was in a town, a go-nowhere town. He was in a go-nowhere job. He just, the, the, the worst economic conditions that you could think of. This young man knew knew what he wanted to do. He wanted to work in health and fitness. He wanted to be the, the changing voice in his community that was extremely unhealthy. He did what he had to do to get here because it mattered to him. So same thing with you, same thing with anybody. And it could be our nutrition conference. It could be something else. There's always reasons not to do anything. There's always reasons to quit. There's always reasons to not start. And that's bullshit. And that's your full of shit. You are fucking full of shit. Get a fucking second job. Go fucking deliver pizzas. Man, I used to drag a rusty ass fucking lawnmower, push lawnmower, not a motorized lawnmower, a rusty ass push lawnmower around my fucking neighborhood every day, every day after school and on weekends to just to dry and drum up five dollars, five more dollars, five more dollars, five dollars, cut your fucking lawn. Big lawn, little lawn, five fucking dollars. Let's get this shit done. That's the attitude. If you want to be fucking successful, if you want to be successful, if you want to get it done, you have to get it done. Put yourself out there. Make it hard. Challenge yourself. People don't challenge themselves enough. And, and Trev Trevis, I'm not talking to you here. I'm talking to everybody. We don't challenge ourselves because we set up reasons for us to fail. We set up reasons for us not to take that step. And that's bullshit. That's fucking bullshit. So what's the worst thing that happens, Travis? Worst thing that happens is you fucking contact us and you say, hey, I really want to come out there. I only got this much money right now. We say no problem. Pay us what you have. Pay us what you can afford. And when can you pay again? And when can you pay after that? Let's break it down. We do that. I don't give a fuck. As long as you're down, we're down. Will you take that step and get set up? Will you work your ass off, side jobs, day jobs, night jobs, part-time jobs? Will you do what you need to do to make sure you got everything locked up? Fuck, in four weeks' time? Four weeks' time, any, any, any American right now can make an extra two grand in four weeks if you're fucking down, if you're about it, if you're about it. And shit, for a three-day trip out here in Las Vegas, you could, you could probably get your hotels in under 200 hours checking the checkout out here in Vegas. Food, inexpensive. There's a, you know, bring some fucking oats and chia seeds with you like I do when I travel around the world. Water is, is basically fucking free. Buy a few fucking gallons when you get to town at the local Walmart. Um, you know what I'm saying? So I'm just saying, whether, it, whether it's our, our certification course or it's something else in your world that you want to achieve, you got to do it. You got to, got to, got to, got to do it. 